Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and today we are watching The Flash Season 7 Episode 8. This one's titled The People vs. Killer Frost and now I'm just excited for this. You know what, let's just jump right into this episode. Let's watch this. Here we go. If I don't own up for my choices, I'll never be able to move on. What about yeah. all the things you've done? About the life we're building together. I'll miss you too. But it's gonna be fine. Do, it's gonna be fine. The city won't look at me the way you all do. Nope. Isotopic signature detected. The forces. One of them is close. It's the strength force. Bear, you have to go. This is the chance we've been waiting for. Let's go. To the cosmic lady. Let's go against Forza. If Forza is back, the people need the Flash. We've got Frost back. Iris is running comms. I'll come with you. If that monster is here, it won't be a match for us both. Oh, the Speed Force and Barry teaming up. I really love the effects. The lightning of the Speed Force. You know what I mean? Don't cares. That's a nonprofit that helps those in need. Why would Forza be there? Hmm. Maybe it's her vessel? So or, as you I don't can know. see, Your Honor, my client has Human form? already demonstrated. She's a flawed person who has changed her ways and become a hero in her own right. Well argued, Ms. Horton. But the state has one goal. To ensure that this extremely dangerous criminal no longer threatens our good citizens. Which is why we believe she must have her powers erased. Ooh. Ooh. Honor, that is highly irregular. That Killer Frost be compelled by this court to take the metahuman cure. What? N no. We need to fight fire with fire. Hack Kramer, dig up dirt, whatever it takes Ooh. to save Frost. No. I didn't just turn myself in so that I could go and break the law again. She's gonna... We're doing this by the book or not at all. Okay, yeah, Katie? do things by the book. Ugh. We'll see. We'll see where this goes. Something still doesn't sit right. Mm hmm Why would Kramer go so hard to take you down? There's still so much we don't know about these forces. We know all we need to. They're dangerous. I still remember how they attacked me. Eating me alive? Wherever these things came from, they have to be stopped. Yeah, I'm not so sure. What do you mean? Well, the Sage Force is clearly dangerous and Fuerza too, but do you remember what Chester and Cisco said about Dion, the Still Force? That he was just a kid who wanted to be left alone. Something doesn't add up here. Barry, the creature that we're hunting killed someone and tried mm. to kill you. We can't let ourselves be fooled by the human facades these forces hide behind. Underneath them, these forces have only one goal. To destroy everything they touch. Hmm. You need to remember that. Interesting. Why do I feel that something's up with her? The things that he said about, you know, them hiding in a human facade. That's what she's doing. She's hiding in a human facade. What if this is not the speed force? Maybe this, this is another force. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Barry can feel her. Maybe it's actually she's actually the 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 speed force, but she's really pushing it. You know that th these forces are evil. Huh. Time to move. Great. Cisco, is the coast clear? I am back looping security cameras now. You have two nice. minutes before they're back up. You're going to attach the inertial oximeter mm. to the door. It's going to send out a pulse that will neutralize all... I think Kramer got the something. cure from Argus. Maybe there. that's what she was there earlier. Why Can she's there. Oh. <laughs> you seem lost. Caitlin Allegra needs backup. Kramer's got her pinned. <laughs> Ten minutes. That's that's all I'm asking. Okay. You've got five. Thanks. 
Let's go sit. Oh, nice one, Allegra. Nice one. Ten seconds. Go, 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 go. Yep. Hurry. Nice. The cure has been neutralized. Now get the hell out of there before I have a heart attack. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh, that's good. But Wait, I think Kramer so still got her own cure. I don't know. No, 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 no. Barry, the answer is simple. If she won't come to us, we'll make her. What? We move in the blink of an eye. She'll never know. And by the time she does, we'll test her. And if she's innocent, return her before she takes her next breath. Nora, <laughs> I know you're new to all of this, but we don't just grab people and test them against their will. Why not? Because lives are at that's stake. Not how this works. Well, maybe it should. Ooh. Mary, you and I know what this thing is really capable of. Now, all I'm asking is for you to trust me and do what needs to be done. You're asking him to give up a part of what makes him a hero. So, yes, Nora, it is too much. Barry. It's your choice. Yeah, it's your choice, Barry. Of course he's gonna side with Iris. She's fought alongside Earth's greatest heroes to save the world, which means that she's saved every person in this room, including those who want to lock her up for being who she was. Not for who she is today. Yeah. I don't understand how this court can force Frost to take that cure without sacrificing what it stands for. Justice. Yeah. Oof. Yeah, it's a good idea. Thank you, Captain Ross. Having Joe there. Your word goes a long way in this court. Yeah. CCPD security cameras were hacked at the exact moment oh. the was destroyed. We wouldn't have found out if not for Miss Kramer's expertise in military intelligence. <laughs> she uncovered the hack herself. Of course. It was me, Your Honor. I did it, not Frost. Can the court assume the state is no longer seeking it as a punishment? On the contrary. Yep. Just got more. And where exactly did you get that? My colleague, Miss Kramer, knows the magnitude of the meta criminal we are dealing with. So she contacted Argus on behalf of the state and had them replicate the cure based on CCPD samples. Shit. We should have 100 vials ready by nightfall. <laughs> It makes it worst. This is for your own good. Man. She better be... Happened. Have a good reason. Lost. Why she's so hell-bent on taking down Frost. Well, it's her job. That's what she's tasked to, but... Damn. Why would you give up two decades of your life when there is a perfectly safe solution? Changing who I am is not a solution. One who said the cure should always be a choice. Then why won't you choose this? Oof. Man. I was part of a team building low-income housing that week. And I just remember feeling so angry when abracadabra destroyed our work site mm. i don't remember much else what if i oh my god what if i am this monster help me find out trust me i know how scary it is to not have full control of yourself i just I feel so weak mm. Look at this. This notes from the so people you've helped. See these cards. It's not a monster. You've dedicated your life to selflessly helping those in need. Finding out the truth about yourself, it's the same thing. They followed a meta I thought was a hero into a hot zone, but he fooled me. Ooh. By the time I realized his betrayal, 20 soldiers lost their lives. Lives I was responsible to protect. Never again. This isn't just about me. You want to go after all metahumans. Only the criminals. 
Mm. But your sentence will set the legal precedent. First, you take the cure, and any meta who endangers the good of the people will have to follow suit. You cannot be serious. But there is nothing you can do to stop this. I don't know Doesn't about that. Justice always wins. Hmm. Some of you only think of me as the criminal I used to be. Back then, I was only interested in protecting myself. But then, I found someone else worth protecting. And protecting that person led me to protecting the whole city. I learned how... I learned how to be selfless instead of selfish. I learned that I'm my best self when I'm protecting other people. I am submitting a request for life in prison without parole. Whoa. What? A ruling for the cure sets it as a viable punishment. A ruling against it takes it off the table. Like my old law professor used to say, in order for justice to be blind, sometimes she must open her eyes to ugly truths. Therefore, I hereby sentence the metahuman criminal known as Frost. Frost. To life in prison without the possibility of parole. Okay. How is this good? We're not gonna see her again? Hmm. So if you're, if you're right about all this, won't I change? Because if that happens, I could hurt someone. And you won't hurt anyone. We're, we're only administering a tiny dose, just enough to trigger the smallest change inside you on a microscopic level. So if something is inside you, our instruments will tell us. Hmm. Something bad is about to happen. Are you still sure you want to do it? Or maybe Speed Force is going to do something. Okay. I don't know. <laughs> Nothing. Just the way you inspired Barry to reach out to Alexa. You really are his lightning rod. Okay. Alexa. I think that confirmed it. Stop Can you hear now. Me? <laughs> <laughs> You're safe here. We're gonna help you deal with this. I promise. Hey. Ooh. Whoa! Oh shit! She wants her powers. She wants the the force. Don't get it. If I don't end her now, she'll sacrifice me to get what she wants. You may be his lightning rod. But I'm the lightning. Oh, shit. Woo! Oh, my God. Yeah, she's the speed force. Shit. She's dead. Time to choose a side, Barry. <laughs> oh shit. Well that escalates. Oh wow. Wow, <laughs> that's a complete 360 turn from her character or so far from what we've seen from her, the speed force. Wow, that is amazing. This is actually a really good episode. So, um, Frost have been sentenced to life imprisonment with parole.
uh, without parole, we're still gonna see her, right? But for now, we're she gonna stick with with Caitlyn again, without her around. Or maybe they're gonna find a way to, you know, release her legally. I don't know, but we'll see. We'll see where they go from here. So now we found out why Kramer really hell bent on taking down Frost, and they want that the the punishment should be um, her taking a cure because she's gonna set this as, as an example. She's gonna suggest that um, giving a cure to you, a uh, meta human, should be imposed as you know as a legal punishment, but they avoided that. Man, she she saved the meta humans, and then we found Forza or her human form. I think Alexa is just a human who is tapped into the the strength force, right? That's what it is. Just like Flash tapped into speed force. But man, speed force just straight up killed her. And yeah, Barry tried to. Uh, the speed force tried to, you know, kill Iris, but then Barry countered it with his lightning. But she's the lightning. Speed force is the lightning. So he just caught her his lightning, contained it into his own her own lightning, and threw it to um, Alexa, and then Alexa died. Oh my god. Oh, this is getting so good. So good. And I hope you guys enjoyed my reaction for this episode. So there you go, guys. This is The Flash Season 7, Episode 8, The People vs. Killer Frost. Let me know your thoughts about this in the comments below. Hit the thumbs up button if you love, like, and enjoy my reaction for this episode. Full version is in my Patreon. If you want to watch it, you can head into my page. Links of that is in the description below. And yeah, I'm just really thankful for all of you guys for your support. And please subscribe to my channel for reactions every week. And thank you. Thank you for watching. Want to watch more reaction videos? Please click here to subscribe.